Welcome back. It is time for the messenger once again. Uh, I think I'm lost. <laughs> I think that's my memory of... Oh, yeah. All right. So I did wander around the Temple of Time HQ for a little bit. But I have to tell you, I'm just going to look up how to get True Sight. Because it's been too long of me running around. And I feel like... Uh, I feel like the problem is I've advanced the story far enough that like I actually don't know how to do this. Uh, yeah, hang on. How do I do this? Okay, here we go. Yes, yes. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. It looks like I was supposed to go back to Syrian Crag, which makes sense. That's probably the first thing I would have tried. But instead of guessing and potentially running around for 10,000 years, I just did this instead. Where is the boss? So this is the area I got kicked to. It's over here, right? I'm pretty sure it's over there. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, we'll see how this goes. I think that's right. We'll just spin. Ooh. And then keep going up. Uh, interesting. I don't know if timeline matters. I think it doesn't. Nice. Uh, there's one more, right? Oh, that was crazy. You can hit some angs in this game. Like I said, this game must be such a sweet speedrun. Oh, goodness, that was bad. <laughs> this is right, right? Oh, actually, I actually have no idea. I think so. This looks like the top of the thing. Anyway. Okay, so I was supposed to come back here. And now I have to go back to the ninja village, which is actually one of the most frustrating places to go back to. But anyway. Okay, well, didn't have to do that much cheating to figure out where I'm supposed to go. But definitely, I'm pretty confident I cannot advance any further in the game without it. Even though I've done a bunch of other stuff since then. The fact that I have to go all the way back through Autumn Hills it's very frustrating, but whatever. Mainly because, especially since the warp is like not that close. <laughs> it wouldn't be that bad, but it takes so long. I should really stop collecting the things. It's actually just a habit now. Man, I can definitely tell that I have played some of these levels too long. <laughs> Starting to get a little too familiar, you know? Oh, speaking of familiar. Familiar with dying, maybe. Oh, there's definitely a way over that, but whatever. This isn't that slow. In fact, it's arguably pretty fast. Because of the turbo. Uh, speed. Uh, that's bad. Oh. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> oh, what? I do not know how I took damage there. I think I have to go... Backwards in time. Oh, what? I also don't know how I missed that. Uh, Al? There's probably some really cool sequences involving chasing fireballs. Uh, it's fine. Oh, I thought I was maybe not going to make it for a second there.
it's like kind of fun trying to find more efficient ways through the level, but backtracking is only so fun. I think that's one of the big challenges of any Metroidvania style game. Trying to make the exploration and backtracking fun is really hard. And I think for the most part, this game does a good job, but this is the one section of the game that is very frustrating to get back to. Like I had to walk all the way back here. And there's just nothing really around. Anyway, so we're now going on the quest I was supposed to go on like, I don't know, 10 episodes ago, and then I got distracted. But hey, all about fun. I have. Goodbye. What? <laughs> is it literally just a light source? That's very funny. This game has got such a good sense of humor. All right, where's this other power seal that I'm missing? I think I can go... F Wait, that's where it is? All right, well, we're going to see if we can't find that power seal. Because I feel like I might be able to find it now. Got to go... Basically to the end. Alright, Autumn Hills, once again. This game is so long. I think I've said this a few times, but I am very impressed with how, oh my goodness, how long this game ended up being. Oh, that's unfortunate. It's fine. Wait, they're chasing me. Oh. Ooh. That was exciting. I don't think it matters what order I go in. Oh, that was sick. Uh... I have to go up, right? I think that does mean I have to be here. I guess this level actually uses the game's gimmick pretty well. Oh, could have jumped there. Oh, whatever. Because it basically creates two sections, right? An upstairs and a downstairs. Man, there'd be so many little things to think about. Just thinking about speedrunning this game, like, you'd have to think about, like, when to use your shuriken, when to use your charge attack, enemies, fireball placement, cycles. I had an idea that I still might do, because I think it's a cool idea, where I was, after I finished playing the game, I was going to react to a speedrun of the game. I've never seen one before. I've seen a lot of speedruns. Big fan of speedrunning. But, never seen one for this game. So I think it'd be kind of cool to like, oh goodness. To see like, what did I miss? Is anything, did anything I think of actually make sense? Like there's definitely going to be a ton of damage boosting in this game. I mean, it's based on a game that has a lot of damage boosts. What? That is very annoying. I feel like sometimes the sequence feels very easy. And other times, oh my god. <laughs> it feels like that. Yeah. I'm definitely getting... I mean, obviously I've learnt a lot about the game, generally. Getting a lot better about using the grappling hook. I think that was the biggest level up for me. Oh. Like, there's just so many times that item just enables, like, a ton of really cool stuff. Guess I'll go get this. Oh, even that. Oh! <laughs>
Okay. Bye bye. Oh man. That's kind of sucks. Wow, that's like the max jump up. Oh! <laughs> Almost made a mistake. Nice. Don't really know if it's worth it, but it's fun. Oh, I died. I think it is where I died. Oh yeah, this enemy is very annoying. Wait, no. Yes, no! That would have been cool. Whatever, we'll just do it the normy way. Keep going. I hope this works. Also, I don't know what it does. Like, it's a candle. Do I have to use it? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Where's my menu? Okay, wow. So that isn't gonna help me find... Interesting. So actually, oh my goodness. That was just a straight up sprint. So it is just for... It is just for the cave. Which, that's fine. So how... Wait. I think I just... I hope this hasn't been as easy as it looks, but... I mean, surely not, right? So there's a thing here. I've definitely seen that. Yeah, how do I get down here? Hang on, that doesn't even go anywhere, right? Unless... Maybe it does? Where does this go? This goes to this room. Okay, so I need to change the time stream. I feel like I've done this so many times. And it's just never made sense. But... I guess I'm committing to figuring it out? For reasons? Honestly, almost faster to warp and walk back. The problem is I don't remember. I'm so far, actually. But, like, surely I've tried this, right? Have I just literally never tried to go here in the past? Is that all I have to do? There are catacombs. I don't think I can. That would. That would kind of make sense if I had to go. Well, hang on. Let's let's go to that area. I mean, at this point, I'm committed. I think it's very silly, but I mean, sometimes you have to do silly things. Oh goodness. Thought I was gonna get hit by that fireball on the way over. That would have been very unfun. Nice. Oh, we're oh, good. So there's these. They aren't real. Wait, hang on. I know you can't do this because. I mean, I'm gonna show myself why. But it's because the tree. Like the area I need to go to change time. It's all coming back to me now. I must have tried this so many times. Okay, so it's this area. Wait, no, this area might be okay. This is not the area I was thinking of. Not that I remember where the change is, but I'm up above here. So in theory, 
If I can change the time, I should be able to get back to the other spot in the past. I also feel like going catacombs is probably faster. Oh, no. Is this why? I mean, this looks completely unplayable. Unless... Uh, there's nothing over there, right? Yeah. I mean... Looks pretty, but... Can't get out of bounds there. If I do the loop-to-loop, -loop, what happens? I think it resets to the same... I think it just resets to the same... Uh... Oh, uh, it's fine. I'm specifically trying to do this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that... I think I have tried that too. Let me go to the catacombs. Wait, where's the catacombs warp? I mean... Oh, do I not have one? I swear there was one. This game. Because that might be the other way to do this, right? There is a catacombs warp, right? This is it, surely. Is this not, oh, this is Howling Grotto? This is not Catacombs. Oh, okay, never mind. Is this also the wrong area? Yeah, that goes to Kushu Marsh, right? Not Autumn Hills? That looks like this, not this. Okay, hang on. Let's go back to, s where was I? Autumn Hills. Alright, let's go to Autumn Hills and then go to Catacombs. I swear. This feels like such a waste of time. So where is that warp? I mean, it might be a waste of time, but I do want to know. Ugh, another Autumn Hills episode. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to go to the Catacombs see if that changes anything. Oh, please do not spike me. Oh. Oh, that was cool. Go up. <laughs> no. We are going down. Oh, I thought that was going to kill me. This next screen, I have to go down. I don't know if this works, but we're going to try it. This is the only other thing I can think of that would work. Oh. That was spooky. Wait, why are these here? Go away. Okay. And I think there is a way to change the time close-ish to here. So I'm in the future, I need to be in the past. Almost forgot the skeletons again. Oh. This is like such a trick if this is the intended way to do this, by the way. There's some level of me that's like, oh, it's cool that you have to like bridge time rifts between different levels to do stuff. And then there's another part of me that's like, this is too much. Oh, that didn't work. We're fine, thankfully, but I'm going to go up to that thing near me because if I realize that there is no way for me to get back, Uh, then at least I have a warp. 
Oh no, it's this one. <laughs> Wait, maybe this is okay actually. Oh, this one's weird, but I think it's playable. But I think if I leave this way, yes. Now, can I get back? Can I get back? I don't think so. I think it's closed. Yeah, I'm supposed to go left and I can't go left. So are we for me to warp out of here? I don't think that does it either, actually. Here. Well, I can't from here. Okay. I'm just going to say it's not possible. <laughs> but we can get here. I don't think I have a warp here, right? I have to go there. Okay. Well, let's just go there then. That's fine. Whatever. This is fine. This is basically where we wanted to go anyway. Right? Right? Got to go up. Oh. I can go across, I think. Uh, again, that might be a seal I'm going to look up how to get to later. <laughs> Just feels a lot. Hey, games are hard sometimes. It's okay. Nothing wrong with admitting that the game is hard. And that you would rather be shown what to do than have to figure it out. That's what I think, at least. The tea thing was very funny at the end of the day. I think I do have to be here. Oh, wait. No, I have to be here. And we go swimming, right? Oh, we made it. Then I have to change time again? And then swim. I think I remember this. Alright. Well, the candle's gonna help us out. Oh no. It's fine. Oh my goodness. I just waited for my sword to be powered up. Wow, that's actually kind of finicky. Alright. Wait. No. I'm trying to remember if this area is hot or not. I think it's not. Alright, well I guess we're gonna just do this now because this is what we we're supposed to do the whole time this is not a lot of light I can see this being very hard I hope there are no enemies in here, because I don't know how I'm supposed to kill any of them. Oh, it's still dark. Great. <laughs> There's also no... Um... No listed... Power seals. Maybe there are none in here? Uh... This is where I'm supposed to go. Like... I'm supposed to be here. Elevator? Weird elevator. Like, this is the stage of the prophecy I'm on to, basically. Man, this is so interesting. I'm assuming this is the shorter part of... Oh my god, I have to follow this thing? No. Oh my god, how long does this stay open for? Wait, no, this way. I can already tell this is going to be annoying. Did I die? Oh no, bless up. What? What? I guess this is the Forgotten Grove. Alright. See how this goes, I guess. Excuse me? Please stop running away from me. Is this gonna be like an auto scroller? Oh shh. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Like like a joke. Maybe it is. 
This is absolutely wild. No! Okay. This is like the Raging Riverboat ride <laughs> level. <laughs> Which has its charm. That was sick. Alright, yeah. Also, I should just ignore... I don't know why I haven't been, but like, I should just ignore all of the things up. I should ignore all of the like time shard things. I don't need any. I have 3,000. And as far as I know, there's nothing left for me to buy in the game. <laughs> I will say, I think when you get into the groove of this level and understand the cycles, it's probably really fun. But blind? Not so exciting. Alright, we did that at least. Now it's pretty. Oh, this is where the other place is. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so that's all the warps, right? Two, three, four, five, six. As far as I know, that's all the warps. Okay, that's nice. This game, man, is just full of surprises. I guess, chronologically, this is where this should be. Ooh, oh. a thing there. Uh, oh, there's lots of spikes. Okay. Hit the save. This is an absolute wild level already. This climbs back up, it looks like. Oh, ish. In a manner of speaking, yes. What is the blue stuff? I think it's just normal stuff? background, I guess. Uh, that is a pit. I can just barely make out the dotted lines. Okay, that lets me back in. Here. That's where that seal is hiding. Oh my goodness. I do not know what to do. I'm gonna have to fall through the bottom of this. That's pretty obvious. What is this? This shoot me up? It's like a DK bongo, basically. Is this directional at all? No. All right. Oh, there's one over there. This looks completely unhinged. Okay, I think as soon... Oh, I have to go back this way. That's unfortunate. I'm going to go hit the other save point. Should I'll just hit the warp, I guess. Does it save? doesn't save. That's fine. It'll save now. Yeah. Good enough. All right. I think I... I don't know what to do. I think the problem is as soon as you hit... As soon as you hit... Yeah, as soon as you hit... The balls... It's over for you. Oh, actually. Just take damage. It's not that bad. Okay, never mind. I think I thought you couldn't hit the plasma balls at all, but I think you can. Which will make it easier. I was about to say much easier, and I was like, well, that's probably not true. Uh, yeah. Here. Uh, I, oh, I got health. It's actually good. I'm going to just try doing this. Taking damage the whole time. Uh,. Okay, it's definitely possible to do taking damage the whole time. So I'm just going to do it that way. Because <laughs> it seems too hard otherwise. No. Looked like there was maybe something up there for a second. Uh, I don't have any health. How much damage do each of the balls do?
Oh, that is a tough jump. I think if I get to that bottom section though, I might be able to find a window. This is gonna be hard. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why I, I'm not just doing this. Okay. Oh, okay. That is really hard, but, uh, I'm pretty confident I now, now know how to do that. I think actually going this way is just optimal. Oh, even better. Oh, okay, that's even better. Because you don't really need the other part. Man, I have to do three seals in this level. Oh boy. Not looking forward to this. Uh, I died. It's fine. I only take one damage at least. So I can get hit three times. Oh. Perfect. I don't know what determines when the game drops you one, but that's handy. I think the safest way to do this is just to float here. Oh! <laughs> Barely snuck by there. That was fun. That's one of the things that's nice about challenging games in general is like, they are fun. Even if, you know, a lot of the time when you start, you're like, want to die. Nope. Oh, uh, there are so many spikes everywhere. Oh, I'm dead. Oops. Uh, no. I was about to be like, can I go the other way? But I cannot, actually. I think it's genuinely easier just to float down. All right. Next save hit. Okay, so I know what these things do now. These seem kind of fun, actually. These are actually just DK barrels. And those are bouncies. This is the best level ever. This is certainly the most fun level. Oh, okay, so you have to be hit off the thing. You can... Wait, what? Aha! That's looking about right. Now that's really fun. Alright. Bounce, bounce. Boop. Perfect. Oh. Am I supposed to, like, do it again? Yep. That's fun. I mean, I could maybe just float down there, but that's way less fun, right? Alright, next seal is down. There's a lot of down in this level. Oh my goodness. That would have been a very embarrassing death. Uh, that was an embarrassing death. Wait, where am I? Yikes. Wait, maybe I can't grapple into them. I thought I could. Looked like I could. Again, nice little bit of level design here. Like showing you initially how these work, and then it's not too much effort to figure out. Wait, why are they the right way? Anyway, it's not too much effort to figure out that hitting them moves them. They could maybe make it a little more obvious what's happening, but I think it's fine. Why is that gap so hard to cross? I don't like the old version as much. It's way spookier. Well, that was fun. Okay, we hit a save. Bless up. Every time you hit a save, it's like joyous. Just gonna be very safe here. Nice. Oh my god, a bird. Get that out of here.
Nice. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, I took that very safe. Too safe, for sure, but I didn't want to get bamboozled again. Uh, that's bad. It's nice that the game has trained me to, like, just jump. It's like, hey, if it looks like you can't jump, figure out a way. Oh, that's cool. Wait. Interesting. All right, seal up ahead. Above me. Found it. Wait, is that literally how you're supposed to get there? How did I jump? I can't imagine this is how you're supposed to get up there. But I did see it. I don't know what other way I would use though, right? Uh, I feel like I glitched up there accidentally. You know what I mean? Like, but like literally how else am I supposed to get up there? Is this a wall I can grapple onto? Maybe this is just a wall I can grapple onto. It's not that much easier, I will say. Also, here's what it looks like old. Well, the other wall is grappleable. Like, you can definitely rest there. Maybe this wall is gettable? Maybe not. Okay, I'm just gonna assume that I have to reset the timeline to do that. I'm not dead. The bottom is a pit though. That takes me all the way. Oh, that's fun. Uh, oh, that's not as fun. All right, well, we're exploring. We're exploring the level. Right down that waterfall. That's pretty cool. I mean, it's like a sensible way. Uh, all right. <laughs> Back down we go. I wonder how I did that jump though. Kind of curious. Uh, I can also do this a different way, I think. Yeah. That's actually supremely cheesable. I don't know how intentional that was, but I'll take it. One more left. Yep. There is an out on the left. Wow. Did that insta-kill me? Looked like it. Oh, right here. There is something underneath, but it's like... Oh, this kind of level. My goodness. Trying to think what this level reminds me of. Oh, whoops. Can I stop early? No, I cannot. Oh, you actually can't. Uh, I didn't know that, but you can't. What, was it, what am I trying to say? You can't. Uh, you can't grapple. Uh, you can't hit those things. Oh, I panicked. If I didn't panic, it would have been fine. That one's really tight. Looks tighter than the other one. Anyway. Whatever. Mostly fine. Actually, really fine. Nice. Hit that thing, which was good. Oh, I didn't jump. I, I intended to jump. I did not. I felt my hand press the button, but obviously the game feels differently. That's okay. Why is that so tight? Uh, I panicked. I was like too busy dodging the enemies and I should have just taken some time to kill them and not panicked. It's okay though. 
Again. Not... I personally don't mind that games like this can get a little repetitive. Because I like the challenge. Uh, that's bad. I do have to remember that in a lot of levels like this, and this came up in a section many videos ago now. I don't actually remember which one. But when you're grabbing the bottom of pillars to not panic and remember to hold up and not like panic hit the jump button. I do need this bird to die. Forgot to re-grapple, thought I would grab the ledge. Can probably shuriken the bird too. Can you shuriken stuff off screen? Maybe. Might be when we find out if you can or not. Oh, just straight missed. I don't know how much there is to do in this level, but I can tell you that I'm at least gonna get all the power seals in this level. If there's extra stuff to do, you might have to save that. That's okay. Uh, I don't know if the shirt gonna work or not, but it's fine. This looks like a pain. All right, not that bad. Again, don't panic. Just chill. Yep, nice. The fact that you can't fail is really frustrating, but you know, it's part of the challenge. I think my hands just kind of got away from me there. It's like no reason to die there. Definitely, oh, nice. Okay, that's a much more efficient way to kill them. I'm actually just gonna get hit there. Uh, it's fine. Again, no panicking. It's a little scary, but I think it's fine. Oh, okay, nice. Any saves? No saves. Don't die. <laughs> the bottom following me is a pit. panic and die. It does, in fact, look like they're going to hit you. It's very scary. Oh, what? That is not the behavior I thought I would see. Look like it pushed me, like, down. Like, I guess maybe hitting the current is a thing? Oh my goodness, that would have been a tragic death. glad it, it didn't happen, but it would have been a tragedy. It definitely feels like it accelerates. I think that's what's happening. I'm jumping into a waterfall. Okay, I think the other method is better. I think just camping this. And jumping high. Jumping high. Nice. Whew. I absolutely crapped myself there. All right, we made it to the save. Don't know where the final... Oh my goodness. Don't know where the final seal is, but we'll find it. Back to the old world, which is my lesser favorite. I'll admit. Is a keys there or whatever. Oh, that was almost sick. I do not want you to tell me how many times I've died anymore. It is bullying. You're bullying me. I actually don't know how to do that without hitting the spike there. Which doesn't seem ideal. Oh boy. Uh, I feel like my cycle is so wrong now. Yes, you can just float. Which one? Calmly. 
Panicking. Stops panicking. Nice. That was close. You're kidding me. Oh no. Never mind. I mean, only kind of kidding me, right? Okay. That's much easier than what I thought was the intended solution originally. That actually helps a ton. I should have... Oh, I see. It's a cool... Um, I like this mechanic. Uh, don't panic. It's fine. Nice. Emergency grappling hook always gets you there. Oh my god, this is actually a Celeste level. <laughs> Am I shuriken these? Yes! I think I kind of have to, honestly. To do these with any sort of efficiency. Just much, much, much safer. Okay, that didn't feel that bad. There's a save right there. And I'm going there. Uh... Looks like, again, it's another level that you can't avoid getting out of. Are you sure can these two? No. Good to know. I really do enjoy the bouncy sections. I guess I'll figure out where this takes me first. That way. It needs to take me this way. All right. Nice. Go again. Health, please. Nice. Okay. Still, this level's big. It's the other thing. Oh. Uh, nope. It's gonna take me. Oh. Up, up, up. That way. That looks fine, right? We'll see. Yeah. That looks good. Oh, I thought that was gonna <laughs> take me the other way. Huh? Okay. Guess I did not find the correct solution. This way. Then this bounces me the other way. This is a very cool take on the puzzle. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. Whee! That was cool. Yeah, this might be my favorite. Well, it's weird, because, like, the new part of the level I really like. The old part I do not like at all. <laughs> oh, there's stuff in the way. Uh, that's fine. You can fix that. Oh, that's bad. That's actually kind of annoying. This means you have to be nice and clean. All right, now what? Bounces me over there. I want it to bounce me up the other way. Hit this, hit that thing, hit that one, that one, that one. Bounce me up. I think that's what that does. Let's find out. More puzzles. Nice. Oh, there's more. Oh, that's cool. I'm definitely going that way. I want to see what's that way. I think that will work. Oh, this is such a... So much fun design. Okay, I think this works. Yes! Oh, it closes. It's kind of funny. Okay, well, I don't need these, but it's cool that I got them. Oh, I see. I have to, like, time it. That's funny. Wait, is this going to bounce me back? Yes. Okay. So now, it bounces me there. I want it to bounce me this way. Then it's going to bounce me up. And I don't know what that's going to do, but I can't really see. I'm just going to assume that's good. I am assuming that have to buy something else. 
as the last seal. Because this game does not have enough. Oh, that's sad. What? The actual... Okay, can't go that way. Can't go that way either, right? I can change the time though. Probably what I have to do. Still can't go left. Don't go up either. Where does this take me? Oh, well, that's pretty good. Where does this take me? Okay. To hell. Ow. I do not like that enemy. I don't. Sorry, falling isn't that bad. Oh, that angered them. That was maybe the opposite of what I should have done, actually. Nice. Just works 100% of the time every time. Looks like it, actually. Okay, this is pretty cool. Uh, I'll grab that, actually. These enemies are absolute snipers, though. Uh, still almost got me. Down. No! That is a tragedy. Oh my god. That's so dumb. Because I have to do it all again now. Oh, that's so dumb. Whatever. Okay. My own hubris, I guess, got me killed. That's fine. At least these all seem to work. If I had to do a puzzle on a level this big, that would be very annoying. I'm guessing they're not set up that way though. Because that would be too troll. I don't know what I just did, but... I sit. Almost shot myself into the... That is a really mean... I actually trapped myself. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna hit this now. Ooh, that's fun. Don't think it makes that much of a difference. Also, where's the seal? Ooh. Uh-oh. This seems bad. It's fine. Interesting. Where's the seal? Also, I'm definitely, like, weirdly off-axis. Up there? No, how do I get there? What the hell? I have to get shot over that way? I'm so confused. I'm gonna float down. The river is running. Is there anything I can do? Oh, this is the other part of the level. Um, interesting. All right, let's try this. It's not this part, it's this middle section. How the hell do I get there? I have to change the Wait, it's there, right? No. Hang on. I'm getting really confused. Okay, it's right here in the middle of the river. So it's not that section. That is... Oh, that's how I got there. Okay. So how do I get to the seal? <laughs> if I get in the middle there can do it. I have a feeling. I have a feeling that I have to change the timeline. Oh, they didn't even do anything. Oh, it spat me on the ledge. Do I have to change the direction? Hang on. Let me, let me figure something out real quick. I 
don't know what to do. I'm just gonna... Nice. I'm just gonna go back and change the time real quick and see if I can't figure out where I'm supposed to go from here. I can't go left. No. Can't go left from here. Which is where I need to go. What? So this is where I climbed up originally. There's definitely no way to do that. So it must... Oh, crud. It must involve... This is awful. It must definitely involve... This timeline. Which I think means probably bouncing a different way. But I don't know what way I could get bounced. I think that one maybe can get turned. That might do something. Let's see what that does. Oopsie. This is the only thing I can think of to advance me forward. Here's a save. What is here? I guess I can find out. Oh my god. That actually terrified me. That actually jump scared me. Also, why do I feel like this is a boss? Yeah. It's evil. Yep. Thanks, little fairy. It's like a bat, I guess? Oh. Oh no. How rude. Alright, well, let's give this a go. I haven't had to fight a boss in a very long time. Ow. Oh, that's extra bad. Oh my god, that inverts controls. That 100% inverts controls. <laughs> I mean, it had the, the boss setup as well. Um, I'm going to try this maybe one more time. But I have a funny feeling... God, that's actually a horrifying sound. I have a feeling that, given what we've done so far, I'm going to take a little break. But we'll see if we can't figure out a little bit more about this boss fight first. I don't think I can hit these, by the way. How does this help me? Oh, this little platform? Oh, what the hell? Wait, what? What is this boss fight? What the hell? Do I have to beat the boss maybe to get the last thing? Maybe. Uh, this is... Terrifying. I have to dodge a bunch of stuff. On... It is. It is inverted controls. Just spam! Nope! <laughs> Uh, it is funny. Okay, I'm... I think I can at least see... I think I can at least see... The... The... I assume it's a three-phase fight, because most boss fights are. I assume I can at least see... Phase three. So let's try and see that. This does this. And then... I guess that turns. I'll just do that now. Okay. That turns. That turns the projectiles into like things that are slightly more uh less insane, I guess. Like it, I feel like it turns this into stardust you can jump on. That's like the the law reason or whatever. Uh, those trajectories are really wild. Oh my god. I don't want to get hit. Alright. And now this way. Drop, drop. Wait, what? No, it's three platforms. Okay. Well, it should be easy enough to hit. 
I like that they've made the like little platform game easy. Oh, what? Okay, whatever. I gotta hit once. Not a big deal. Phase three, I'm assuming, on a tiny, tiny, tiny island. The tiniest island you've ever seen. You are kidding me. Oh boy. If I don't move, right? Oh no. It's just terrifying because you panic. No! No. Oh my god. Okay, I think I can do this fight. I can't tell if you always move. I actually kind of want to find out. Let me get hit. If you don't press anything... How long does it last? Oh, I also have to dodge stuff. Oh, when you get hit, it wears off? Wait, did I just find a new strategy? Okay. I'm assuming that every phase is enough. Like, every phase you get enough time to damage to change phases. I'm gonna spam shurikens in the third phase, I guess? I thought this would move you. As long as it doesn't deal damage. I think I have to get hit to get knocked out of it. I'll dodge these two, I guess. They don't have forever to tank. Back we go, over here. Shaky, shaky, shaky. I'm gonna just throw these. I just wanna make sure it's enough. Face change again. And now I think I can just tank it for the next few. Yeah, going right again. Yep. Yep. Uh huh. Tank this again. No. Oh my god, I almost just... Wait, uh, we're off! I don't know, we're off. Oh, it does wear off eventually. Nope. Goes again? Oh, I have to hit the thing. And I think this is enough. Where the fudge are my platforms? That is so small. Nice! Okay, that wasn't so bad. Wow, the punishment... It's very severe from making a mistake, but they definitely designed the mechanics to be not as punishing as they could be. They could be really bad. <laughs> oh, yes. Please. Oh, that's good. Alright, well, that's certainly enough for one episode. We did so much. <laughs> How do I use the magic firefly? Doesn't say. Maybe. I don't want to see. I just want to see if this helps me get to the other place. You know? I don't think this helps me get anywhere else that I haven't been able to go. This bounces me up, right? Yep. Maybe this will help. Maybe not? Can't jump out of this box, right? No. Kind of. <laughs> Just, I'm trying to figure out how I would get there.
Oh, I'm stupid. Oh. Now what do I do? Hang on. I think I know what to do. Uh, is that going the right way? No. Oh, no. Uh, this is probably fine. It's not fine at all. Wow, it was so not fine. Alright. I know what to do now, at least. Oh, it, it's so easy to miss, like, one destructible wall. Which makes sense, like... They're supposed to be hidden. <laughs> yeah, and it's just not there in, in this timeline. Okay. Cool. So I have to hit this flower, which... It's kind of annoying. Because, like, you have no way of knowing that otherwise. But whatever. Oh, no. Okay, it's fine. Is this just, like, a big puzzle? <laughs> nope. Okay, we're going to learn a lesson eventually. <laughs> At least it takes you back there. Could be a lot worse. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh my goodness. No. <laughs> it sucks you in, man. It really wants you to get in the flower. Okay. That's actually way easier. Oh. It's literally right there. That shoots me over there. That bounces up. Straight up. Bounces. I might just be right. Does this... I think this keeps everything. It's like a multi-step puzzle. It is a puzzle, by the way. I was right. Let's see if this works. Nope. Hit that. Hit, hit. Should go over and hit that one too if I can. That looks right. I'm pretty sure that's right. Man, this level's sweet. Even that boss was pretty sweet. It was fun to realize instantly what happened. Oh, I'm I'm mad. That's fine. I also will say it is very refreshing to have a power seal that doesn't have any enemies or things that hurt you. Just like, you know, figure out a little puzzle. Alrighty. Well, that is going to be well and truly the end of this very long episode of the Messenger, but we finally did everything we needed to do. We got the candle, we got through the cave, we got all the seals in this area, and we're looking... looking okay. Uh, I guess next we're going to go to the full-on temple, because we've had it unlocked for a bit and haven't been there in ages. So, stick around for that. Uh, as always, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you feel like it. And thanks for hanging out. It's fun as always.